Welcome back to CT Buzz. Get ready to step into style and elevate your footwear game. We are joined live by CEO of Impossible Kicks, John McCadlow. He has a look at the latest footwear trends and an opportunity for you to join in on what he's building. John, thanks so much for being here. Thank you so much. It's wonderful to be home. Absolutely. Yeah. And what's amazing is your footwear company really has grown from Crazy. here in Connecticut to across the country now. Across the country. We're as far west as Hawaii. Wow. And last time we were here, we had 17 stores, and we just opened our 20th store at the Venetian Casino in Las Vegas. Oh, boy. So you're yeah. everywhere. Tell us about Impossible Kicks. So uh, my brother started Impossible Kicks with a trunk full of sneakers, and we just recently got a $64 million valuation. So we built a $64 million uh, company in three years. How'd you do it? Oh, uh, it's crazy. Relentless hard work and great people. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's really the key to success. And great shoes. Great shoes. Yeah, so, you know, um, high-end shoes, sneakers, um, and hard-to-get streetwear. So anything that's a sold-out release, mm. we sell to the public to make sure that everybody finally gets their hands on what they want. Because a lot of times you go to get something and you don't get it. Right, so you got the Nikes, the Jordans, the Yeezys, yep. all that good stuff. Everything. So sneakers from $100 to $90,000. $90,000. Correct. Oh my, so there's something for everyone, truly. Something for everybody. Uh, and let's talk about what's trending right now, because, you know, there's, just like clothes, there's themes and trends in footwear as well. Yeah, so we are in the comfort era, you I know, where this. everybody was wearing, you know, like Jordans and, you know, an Yeezy, which is a really comfortable sneaker, but now everybody's wearing New Balance, ASIC, things that are very, very comfortable that you can wear with the F leisure mm -hmm. or you can still wear with streetwear which is still popular and trendy okay and i love that we were just talking on commercial break you know people go out in las vegas to the clubs and yep. sneakers now <laughs> so we're really embracing the comfort yeah and i'm in it now let's talk about this is awesome uh you have an opportunity for people maybe some of our viewers to join in on uh, what you are building with impossible kicks yeah so uh currently impossible kicks has raised eight and a half million dollars over several rounds um we raised uh we have about 130 investors and uh, you know people have seen six to seven times return on their investment already but we're doing a reg cf which is sanct shank sanctioned by the sec and we're letting the public get involved before we do our next wave of uh, you know, financing or funding. So everybody can get a piece of it because people say, well, I missed out on this, I missed out on this, it's not fair. So we're opening up to the public so that they can buy a piece of the company. That's wonderful. And especially for our viewers uh, in Connecticut, you are from Connecticut. It Born means a raised. little bit more, right? To have that support behind you. Born and raised. You know, it's it's wonderful. And a lot of people look at me, you know, when I'm opening my store in Hawaii and they go, where are you from? I said, Connecticut. And they just look at me, they're like, they really have to think <laughs> about where that it yeah. is. Yeah, and, and, and it's been wonderful. Wonderful. There's been some great support, and it's really nice to put uh, Connecticut on the map for fashion, which, you know, I don't know of anything else for fashion in Connecticut. So I think you are doing wonderful work. So let's talk about if this is something people are interested in. Reg CF, how do they get involved? Um, so they can go right to um, our link on Instagram, and it brings you right to a company we're working with called Dealmaker. Um, it was about nine months of preparation that we went through. It was it was crazy, and uh, you know, I, I made my staff crazy, but they got it all done. And they can go and they can actually invest. It's uh, minimum investment is seven hundred. $50 and you can invest all the way up to $100,000. Right, a lot of opportunities there. John McCaldo, McCadlow from Impossible Kicks, we appreciate yep. your time and congratulations. I Thank mean, you so three much. and a half years you've done wonderful things. We'll have all the details for you on our website, WTNH.com. Stay tuned after a short break. Steve Teeling and I are headed into the kitchen for Trending Tuesday.